Welcome to the Hillsborian Historian. My name is Rex, and today we focus on the class of 1928. This annual was made possible thanks to the efforts of students and businessmen. This Hillsborian is dedicated to all that Hillsborough will achieve in the past and in the future. Principal Spalding presides over a momentous year. This is the final year of Hillsborough High School on Highland. Plant High School had opened in Palmasia and helped alleviate the overcrowding at HHS. In Seminole Heights, the Joe Lyons Estate was being transformed to house a big red cathedral of a high school. It was designed by renowned architect F.J. Kennard, who was known for designing on a grand scale. He had designed the Bellevue Biltmore Hotel, one of the largest wood structures on the planet. He also designed the Hotel Floridan, the tallest building in Tampa until 1966. Controversy arose when the contract for the new high school was given to out-of-state contractor J.L. Krauss. Meanwhile, on Highland Avenue, Terriers became aware that the new high school might not retain the name Hillsboro. Months earlier, under similar circumstances, ancient rival Duval High of Jacksonville had ceased to exist. Terriers united to save the name Hillsboro High School. The school board was also considering the name J.G. Beddingfield, who was a trustee for Tampa School District No. 4. Much passion and terrier spirit was shown, and Mr. Beddingfield removed his name from consideration. It was decided that the new $1 million high school would retain the name Hillsboro. In January 1928, the cornerstone for the new Hillsboro High School was laid by the Grand Lodge of Masons of Florida. Many attended this historic event. Within the cornerstone is a time capsule with copies of newspapers, a roll of county teachers, and a list of students enrolled at the school. The cornerstone was laid square, level, and plum. Corn, wine, and oil were poured on the cornerstone and the grand undertaking was consecrated. Located on the southeast corner of HHS, the sun always rises and never sets on the name Hillsboro High School. Controversy surrounding J.L. Krauss continued despite the fact that he was found to be financially ethical. Nonetheless, in April, the supervisor of city school construction resigned and F.J. Kennard oversaw the remaining construction of the new Hillsboro High School.
soon the final graduating class of Hillsborough High School on Highland Avenue graduated. Its building was filled with terrier history. It was here that the annual was born. It was here that the alma mater was generated. And it was here that terriers united to save the name Hillsborough High School. But now it was time to say farewell. Please subscribe to my channel to keep up with all of my HHS videos. And as always, go Big Red.